What's going on guys? I hope you are doing well. Um, so I just went through Moving Mountains by John Eldridge. Um, I had gone through it before, but I'm really glad I went through it again. Um, he, in the book, he really explores the contours of prayer, uh, trying to be as faithful as possible to the biblical text and just being real about what different kinds of prayer looks like. Like, for example, one kind of prayer that he talks about is the cry of the heart. And that's just kind of that, like, I'm in a desperate place, or it doesn't even have to be, it doesn't necessarily have to be a bad cry of the heart, but it can be just like those, those, those flares up to heaven where you're just like, help. Or it could just be, thank you, Jesus, you know, and when you're overwhelmed with delight or joy. So a lot, but there's a lot more. There's di all different kinds of, of prayers in it. He gives examples. I'm not going to lie. I, I don't know that I vehemently disagree with him on any of the, on any of the stuff he says in there, but I, I, I would say if we were sitting down for coffee, I'd definitely have a lot of questions, but, um, it was a, it's a great book, definitely very thought provoking and makes, uh, I made me want to learn more about prayer. Um, one of the things he talks about throughout the book is that in the same way that the physical world had, um, has a way that things work, you know, if I, I'm on my, uh, second story porch here, if I, not that I could, cause there's a screen, but if I were to drop something off of it, it's going to fall to the ground because of gravity. He says in the same way that the physical world has a way that things work. So the, uh, spiritual world has a way that things work. And he kind of uses that to help navigate you through, um, the, the different aspects of prayer. So interesting book, um, a lot to take in and uh, definitely worth the read. So John Eldridge, Moving Mountains, definitely check it out.